Okay, so what you're gonna see now are three exothermic reactions. The first one is this black stuff, which is potassium permanganate, and I'm gonna use glycerin to light that off. Once that goes, it should burn with a little bit of a purple flame. You won't see that, because once that purple flame shows up, it's gonna ignite the magnesium. Magnesium is like a road flare. It's going to be white, very white, very bright. Don't look at it. Once that goes off, it's gonna ignite the thermite. The thermite is a mixture of iron oxide and aluminum, and it's a redox reaction, and it is a highly exothermic redox reaction that makes molten iron. We like to try to do demos as we go along, and you know, I, I enjoy the ones that go kaboom, but but we do we do demos that range from you know color changes and and um, and these sorts of things to try to to demonstrate it's not just numbers and letters on a board it's actual real science and we can actually see what what happens when, when you when you put science into action you know chemistry is a very important. Uh, in, to our society in general, and it, it kind of gets a bad name, you know, oh, chemical-free fertilizer, and you know, we don't want to add chemicals, and and you know, we, we do want to show that chemicals are important, and, and that the, the world is made of chemicals, and so you know, the, the concept of a chemical-free fertilizer is sort of a little out there. The, the the beauty here about me being at William and Mary, I mean, the reason I came here was to try to be, you know, the inspiring professor that. You know, like the ones that inspired me. I, I you know, I, I recognize that I'm a little bit of a freak, and that, you know, at 19 years old, I said I wanted. This is what I want to do, and I'm, I'm lucky enough to have, to have been able to come to not only to the, the kind of college that I wanted to come to, a small liberal arts type place, but also to one that has the resources to let me do my own research, to inspire kids in the, in the classroom and in the laboratory. I, you know. I'm blessed, very, very lucky that, that there was an opening for me to apply to here at William & Mary, so. Good one! Oh, it's a really good one! There's the iron. Half of my demos don't work, so I think they were just actually kind of excited that one of mine worked for a change. If you want to come look at the iron, it's still molten. Just don't touch it. Don't stick your finger in it. Don't stick your finger in it.